My name is Ed Schwartz. I'm co-chairman of the Western Pennsylvania Ataxia Support Group of the National Ataxia Foundation. Ataxia is the biggest challenge I've ever had to face in my life. About 20 years ago, I began to fall down in the dark. Then after experiencing symptoms of six other disorders over the next 20 years, and a seizure-like reaction to the composite collection of drugs I was taking, I wrecked my truck. I quit driving and shortly after that attended the Brain Conference in Philadelphia. While there, I talked with volunteers at the National Ataxia Foundation kiosk. I felt like I was talking to myself in the mirror. They all had the same walking, coordination, and speech problems like me. We agreed I probably had ataxia. Upon return home, I joined the National Ataxia Foundation, got another MRI along with a diagnosis of atrophy of the cerebellum. An associate of my brother's, a doctor in Cincinnati, informed me of the probable relationship between gluten and ataxia, and he put me on a dairy-free, egg-free, and gluten-free diet. My restless leg disappeared. I subsequently decided that I had sporadic cerebellar ataxia. The visit to the NAF kiosk was the start of a series of diagnoses, directions, decisions, and actions which led to an understanding of my problem. I am not symptom free and don't expect to be unless NAF finds a cure, but I sure feel a lot better about my life now than I did before.